After Patriot missiles and tanks, Ukraine now wants Western fighter jets. The Ukrainian president, Vladimir Zelensky, urged Western nations to speed up deliveries of new and existing weapons. This comes as Ukraine is facing a tough situation in the Donetsk region, which is under constant Russian shelling. The appeal for new weapons has received an early setback. The German Chancellor Olaf Scholz has refused to supply fighter jets to Ukraine. This came after Ukraine had called for the creation of a fighter jet coalition to strengthen air defence capabilities. Earlier, NATO Security General, Secretary General, should I say, Jens Stoltenberg also urged South Korea to increase military support to Ukraine. Stoltenberg is in Seoul with a focus on strengthening ties with US allies in the face of the war in Ukraine and rising competition with China. He said it's extremely important that Russia doesn't win the war to avoid sending a wrong message to authoritarian leaders. Meanwhile, in Kherson, Russian missile strikes killed three people in a fresh round of strikes on Sunday. This comes as the fighting rages on in the Donetsk region. In Kharkiv, a message hit, a, a missile hit an apartment building on Sunday. According to the regional governor, the attack killed one person and injured several people. I was in my bed and I was thinking, thinking and thinking. And suddenly such a strong force swept me up. I flew out of my bed right into the kitchen. How I was not killed, I do not know. There's also a counter-blame game underway. Russia has accused Ukraine of deliberately striking a hospital in a Russian-held area of eastern Ukraine. According to Russia, the alleged war crime killed 14 people and wounded 24 patients and medical staff. Meanwhile, Russia's deputy foreign minister says it's quite possible the New START nuclear arms control treaty with the United States would end after 2026. Russia... U.S. talks on resuming inspections under the New START treaty were called off at the last minute in November 2022, and neither side has agreed on a new time schedule for the new talks. Thank you.